Hey, what's going on guys? My name is George and this is SAS Master. Today we're going to check out Shorby, which is a link shortener used for many cases, but mostly used for Instagram. You know how Instagram just lets you only put one link, so this way you can take advantage of that one link and have many links in one. So let's check out what Shorby actually does. This is the main dashboard and what we're going to do right now is create one new one just to show you how easy this is. So the first thing we're going to check out and let you know is that you can have your own custom domain. Now this is going to depend on the plan that you have that this will be available. So how do you set this up? Well, you head over here to settings, project name, and you add a custom domain. Now this can be a domain or a subdomain. All you have to do is head on over to your hosting plan and set the DNS to point over here. Now it's pretty straightforward, just click here on setup and it's going to show you what you have to do and where you're actually going to point this. So it says point A to this IP address and that way it detects it and now you can have a, like, like a little green light right here and it's going to be available to use. So where are we going to actually use this? Well, let's create a brand new project. I already created one, but we're going to do right now one. So let's create a smart page and the first thing that we're going to do is obviously upload a logo. So in this case, you know what, I'm just going to upload myself, upload. These are just for testing purpose. I just want to show you really quick what you can do and how easy this is to set up. So, okay, there's my logo, set a title and just put it in this case, I'm going to put SAS master. All right, little green tick. There you go. You can also add messengers. So select what type of messengers you want to use. In this case, I'm just going to grab the links over here really quick. Well, actually, all right, I'm going to grab this, but I'm going to just put different links just for the purpose, all right? Let's just say these were the links and oh, numbers only, just to show you a sense of what it's going to look like. Also, this one, all right, and green. See how easy this looks and pops up really good? Now, you might be thinking, hey, you know what? That looks gray and black. Hold on. We'll fix that in a bit. We can also add blocks. So in blocks... We can add URLs, you can add icons, see all these icons that we have right here available. You can add those if you want to use those. Well, let's use one of these. All right, so let's just use this URL again. Let's set an icon, let's just say this, this was Pinterest, right? And do you want it to pop or hide? Leave it like that. And there it is. Do we want to add social links? So in this case, also you can add more social links right here. Let's add this one right here. All right save it and there you go it's messenger you can add those see these little social links down here there it's kind of like a footer thingy like you can see that next thing we're going to do is head on over to settings so in settings we can select theme so what sets the colors that you're actually using in your company so for example hey you know what okay no that doesn't look good for me maybe in my case i'm like this i look this a little bit better and you can also customize so you can set these to actually do your own or select the ones, the combinations that you like. So you have a whole bunch of them. Or you can upload a background image. So you can do that also. And you can select any one of these to grab that image. Next thing we have is the bio link. So in this place, it, it, this is going to depend on the plan that you have. So if you have a plan that, that contains a custom domain, like I told you in the beginning, well, you can see this right here. So links.sasm.co. This is my subdomain. And I can customize this, so I would say SAS Master 2. And we can add tracking pixels. So right here, you can add any pixel that you want. So you have Facebook, Google, Twitter, Pinterest, Quora, LinkedIn, Instagram, Snapchat, all that good stuff. Pixels are a way to do remarketing. So this is the way that you can target people and do marketing with them. Let's just say, for example, that you log into IKEA store and it's like, you know, furniture and that kind of stuff. So when you head on over to other social media sites or even web pages, you see ads and you see Ikea and all that. And you're like, hey, how did they do that? Well, that's Pixel. That's how they do it. So you can add those right there. And once you're ready, you can set star and we can actually publish. So let's publish this one right here. That's available. Let's go to the site actually to go see it. Remember, we have a custom domain and we can go ahead and see it. And this is what it would look like if they open it in a website. Now, how would this look in a mobile look? So let's click on inspect. And this is the way that it will look on a mobile phone. So you can see it looks nice. You can add as many links right here. A whole bunch of links that you can add right here. You can add more. 
add blocks you can add these type of blocks new name text uh, a whole bunch of things you see titles so this is like this like big deal going on and just a whole bunch of text blah 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 <laughs> sorry I like to do this just to show you the meaning so you can add a whole bunch of things make it more custom customizable change to the color of your branding and all that good stuff but I mean did you see how easy this was to set up well this is Shorby. If you guys want to check out a really good deal that's going on, click on the link that's going to be in the description. All right, guys. Well, my name is George, and this is SaaS Master. See you later.